Snowfall is the accumulation of snow and ice in the last 24 hours, prior to melting or settling. With this caveat, your normal observation time may not be ideal for measuring accumulation. Ideally, the best time to measure is right after the snow has fallen. For example, if a storm came through at 10 a.m. and lasted until 2 p.m., you would want to measure accumulation right after 2 p.m., before melting or settling occurred. This is not always feasible for volunteers who are working during the day or may not be home when the snow stops falling. This is okay too. If you are not at home when the snow stops falling, you can still measure the snowfall at your normal observation time. If you know what time the snow stopped falling, or if snow was falling while you are taking your measurement, please add this to your observation comments when entering the data. To measure accumulation, first find your snow measurement board, which should be easy since you remembered to mark its location with a flag or reflector. Slide your snow stick or ruler straight down into the snow towards your snow measurement board. Try to get down close to where the ruler meets the snow, because if you are looking at an angle, you will get an inaccurate measurement. Write down the measurement to the nearest tenth of an inch. You can also take multiple measurements in representative locations and calculate an average measurement. Before you clear your snow measurement board, you will want to take your measurement for the liquid water equivalent of snow, explained in the next section. When you are done, you can clear your snow measurement board and place it on top of the snow, so it is ready for the next time you measure. Report your measurement in the field, accumulation of new snow in inches to the nearest tenth.